0FXB, welcome to my channel. This is the M17 Open RTX board. There's a few videos out there, but it's, it's been a bit of a learning curve for me to be able to install the firmware to the board. You can get the board from AliExpress, it's not expensive, about £30. And the idea of this board is that it will turn a radio with a nine with a nine pin output and with this connector here into a M17 digital radio transmitting over RF. So it's excellent and it does come with an OLED screen which could be soldered to the board. I've chosen to, uh, to keep it separate for now. I'm just gonna quickly show you some of the settings that I have never ever used this ever. So I am doing it for the first time. And now I wish I did um, <laughs> solder it to the board because it's a bit harder doing it two-handed, but I'm just gonna click menu here, it says enter here and escape here. Escape where my thumb is, enter just here. So we're gonna click enter, like so. And it says settings, we're just gonna go through them one at a time, I don't know what they do, but it's still interesting. So we go enter, and then we're gonna go up and down. We can go, I think, left and right. We're just gonna go up and down. So go enter, display, contrast, and timer. And then we'll just go back out with the Escape, go down, M17, enter, call sign. So it looks like we can add our call sign. I don't know what can and can't can RX means, but that's all good. Escape, module 17, enter, TX spot, RX spot, TX phase, RX phase and mic gain. Escape. Default settings, enter, reset to defaults. We're not gonna do that, so we'll escape. Now, the other things I've noticed about this board, or oh, see the way it says menu there. I wonder if if um, if any if I push any of the other buttons, anything happens, no. So it's just, that's your menu, and then escape. I did notice there's a reset button here. Now to put this into firmware mode, you turn it off, you know, pull the plug out and it will be, you can power it using a, a DC input or USB-C there. And to get it into firmware mode, just pull that out, hold down the escape button, which is here. Just bottom left if the screen was fitted. The top left, sorry, the top left. And actually says escape. Hold that down, plug it in and it will be in firmware mode and you will know because when you look at your PC, it will show this. And then I'll just attach at the end of this video, the firmware installing. Okay, mod firmware, continue to download. Right click, show in folder, double click, extract to, I'm going to put it in this folder up here, extract M17, which is empty at the moment. Desktop. There it is there. Click OK. So it's up here now. This is what you've just sent me. Flash firmware. Oh my God, it's working. There you go. That's all we needed. So we just need to know that that, that file, or that group of files that you've sent me can be downloaded by everyone. I can link it into the video and, um, and then everyone's happy.